I quoted from Psalm 9, verse 19. You declare it again because what you cannot declare, you don't deserve it. And, and what you cannot pronounce, you cannot procure it. And what you cannot say, you cannot see it. And what you cannot say, you cannot see it. And what you cannot say, you cannot see it. Say, arise, O Lord. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Don't let them prevail. <laughs> let my adversaries <laughs> be judged in your sight. <laughs> Say, arise, O Lord. <laughs> and let your judgment <laughs> visit my adversaries <laughs> in the name of Jesus Christ. <laughs> He said many times they have afflicted me. Even from when I was young. Yet they have not prevailed against me. Psalm, Psalm 129 verse 2. Many times they have afflicted me. Even from when I was young. But they have not been able to prevail against me. Say Lord arise. Sorry. <laughs> And swallow them up. Amen. Say, Oh Lord, arise. Oh, Lord, sorry, oh. And swallow them up. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Say, I declare every form of affliction. Uh, how be, uh, every form of attack. Uh, how be, uh, every form of assault. Uh, against my destiny. Uh, in the past. Uh, in the present. Uh, and those in the future. Uh, arise, Oh Lord. Uh, and swallow them up. Arise, O Lord, and aspire them. Arise, O Lord, and swallow them up. Arise, O Lord, and aspire them. In the name of Jesus Christ. A closed mouth is a closed destiny. The Bible says that when you resist him, then he will run away from you. Say, Arise, O Lord, and save me. Oh, my God, for you have smitten all my enemies upon the cheekbone. Oh, my God, 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 my Say, arise, O Lord. Sorry. Save me, O my God. For you have smitten all my enemies upon the cheekbone. And you have broken the tooth of the ungodly. In the name of Jesus Christ. Say, Lord, arise and smite them. Say, Lord, arise and break their jaw. In the name of Jesus. Jesus Christ, oh, yes, yes, say yes, I yes. declare yes, whatever yes. is an enemy yes. to my destiny, yes. whatever yes. is an opponent oh, yes. to yes. my yes. expectation, yes. arise, O oh Lord, yes. and smite them down. Yes. Arise, O oh Lord, yes. and strike them down. Yes. Arise, O oh Lord, yes. and paralyze them yes. by fire. Yes. In the name of Jesus oh, yes. Christ. Yes. Anything you don't resist has the right to prevail. Anything you don't resist has the right to prevail. And it is your utterances that God will validate and confirm. And you must utter the right things. If you don't utter the right things, you cannot actualize your victory and your dominion. Say, arise, O oh Lord. Sorry. In your anger, lift up yourself. Because of the anger of my enemies, I work for me, O God, for the judgment that you have commanded. Psalm 7, verse 6. When you declare the word of God, it makes your utterances very poisonous and dangerous. Yes. When you declare the word of God, your utterances become very toxic, disastrous, dangerous, destructive 
to the works of the enemy. Something must break and something must expire. Say, Arise, O Lord, in your anger. Lift up yourself against the rage of my enemies. Away from me, O God. To the judgment you have commanded. In the name of Jesus. Oh, yes. Say, my Father, let your judgment be executed in my favor. Let your judgment be executed against my adversaries. In the name of Jesus. Say, I declare. Say, I declare. Every rage of the enemy. Every Rich of the enemy against my progress, against my glory, against my star. I silence you by fire. I silence you by fire. In the name of Jesus, say I declare any creature that is angry because I am happy. Any creature that is angry. Angry because I am healthy. Any creature that is angry because it is well with me. Arise, O Lord, and paralyze them by fire. Arise, O Lord, and paralyze them by fire. In the name of Jesus Christ. Now declare this one too. Say, O oh Lord, arise and lift up your hand. Say, O oh Lord, arise and lift up your hand. And let me be remembered for good in the name of Jesus Christ. Your boss must remember you for good. Somebody that God has ordained to help you, he must remember you for yeah, good. Somebody that God uh, has empowered to be a blessing to you, he yeah, must remember you. Yes. Psalm 10 verse 12. That is what I wanted. Say, arise, O Lord. Sorry, oh. Lift up your hand. And cause me to be remembered. In the name of Jesus Christ. Say, I declare. Any agency. <laughs> Any agent that must remember me, any agent that must help me, any agent that must facilitate me, will not arise. Lift up your hand and let them remember me. Lift up your hand and let them remember me. In the name of Jesus, say I declare every move. Every move uh, spiritually, every move uh, administratively, every move uh, socially, every move uh, system wise, every move uh, system wise uh, to cause me to be rejected, to cause me to be stagnated, to cause me to be Arise, O Lord, and let it scatter. Arise, O Lord, and let it scatter by fire. By fire. By fire. In the name of Jesus Christ. Before David brought down Goliath, he brought him down by his words. David did and so silence mouth will lead to silence destiny. Silence <laughs> destiny. You, you have to be vocal in the realm of the spirit. You have to be vocal in the realm of the spirit. Otherwise, the enemy will push you aside. Uh, otherwise, the enemy will cause you to be erased and dismissed. Oh. Say, arise, O Lord. And disappoint him and cast him down and deliver my soul from the wicked in the name of Jesus Christ. Psalm 17, verse 13. We are declaring it. Psalm 17, verse 13. Say, Arise, O Lord, and disappoint him and cast him down and deliver my soul. 
from the hand of the wicked. In the name of Jesus. Hello, precious one. I believe that message has blessed you mightily. If you want your sins to be forgiven, I want you to pray this prayer with me. I want you to give your heart to the Lord. That is what will make the work of God or the word of God to come to pass in your life. So wherever you are, pray this prayer with me right now. Say, Dear Lord Jesus, forgive me all my sins. Wash me with your precious blood. Come into my heart. Be my Lord and my Savior. For I believe that you died for me and you rose for me. Make my life a testimony to all who know me. Thank you, Lord, for answering my prayer. Amen and Amen. I still want to pray for you. If you are sick in any part of your body, God is going to heal you right now. Jesus has paid for your sicknesses already. You don't have to carry the sickness. So wherever you are sick at, lay your hands there right now. As I pray for you, God is going to touch you. In the name of Jesus Christ, I take authority over every spirit of sickness and disease, every spirit of weakness, infirmity, every spirit of oppression that is harassing your health. I hold them bound in Jesus name and I command them to come out of your body now in Jesus mighty name I declare healing for you right now wherever you are sick at I speak healing into your body from the top of your head to the sole of your feet be made totally well in Jesus mighty name Amen God bless you you can fellowship with us at the Perez Chapel International Grace Cathedral Tema Community One Meridian near the tigo office this and every sunday from 8 a.m to 10 a.m wednesday from 5 30 p.m to 7 30 p.m on friday 5 30 p.m to 7 30 p.m come and your life will never be the same see you there